today we have none other than Terry Berry, TB, Terry Berry, Taekwon World, Terry, TB, Homicide Incident Report, and we will be revealing it today. So we go ahead and hit that subscribe button and thumb up the video. Thumb up that video because it helps me get my videos out to new viewers. So I need, it is crucial that you guys thumb up these videos so that I can keep feeling motivated to do such um, and bringing you these cases. And if you have not done so, go check out some of those audio files too, man. Like those are some, some really good insights in them. And I think I cut some of them down to key moments where, you know, you guys could correlate, you know, events from that to other things as well. You know, it's all for content purposes. So with that, with all that being said, man, we're going to jump right into this. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. So today we got TB, uh, Terry Berry, and we're going to get right into it. We have an incident. Uh, and uh, we only got about four uh, pages of this incident report. I have filed another FOIA for, for more documentation, uh, additional documentation than uh, just this incident report. So we're still on hold and waiting for that. But just the FYI. So for today, we only got uh, the incident report that we will be reporting on. So yeah, let's check it out. All right, we have a double uh, zero one double, uh, excuse me, zero one one zero homicide and first degree murder code. Um, we also have a battery aggravated handgun. All right, and let's see, occurrence date, September 26, 2017, 12.45. All right, and we have victim individual named Terry uh, T.M. Barry. Um, he is a was a male black, six feet, 155 pounds, brown eyes, black hair, short hairstyle, medium brown complexion, all right, um, age was 21 years of age. There's another victim here listed as a Marcus Clark. All right, and he uh, was a, uh, is a male black, six feet, 160 pounds, brown eyes, black hair, short hairstyle, medium brown complexion. His age was 24, or is 24 years, ago, uh, years old. And we have a witness individual here that is redacted and no demographic information there. All right, and that's the first uh, document on the incident report. We go down to the number two here. All right, and yep, of course, so we have the injuries for the victim. Uh, injured uh, by offender, C CPD first aid given, yes. CFD first aid, yes. All right, a uh, little jumbled there. Injury extent is fatal. Hospital he was taken to, Northwestern Memorial. All right, and so the second victim, so that was for uh, TB, Terry Berry. Uh, the second victim's injuries, uh, injured by offender. CFD first aid given, yes. CFD first aid given. Oh, excuse me, CPD first aid given, yes. CFD first aid given, yes. Injury extent is serious yet not fatal hospital uh cook county all right we have injury info to a witness but nothing is uh listed we have a suspected a suspect uh, with a name unknown but they believe it's a male black it was two suspects excuse me that they believe are male black individuals all right and that covers the second page all right, we have relationship to offender on this page, uh, and there is none. Uh, flash message was sent out in relating to this uh, shooting. All right, and we had a vehicle that was not damaged, but I guess part of um, the case is a 2011 Chrysler uh, four-door, blue, dark, blue, dark. Uh, owner is a one Dwayne Smith. All right, and that's it for that document there. We're going to the fourth one. All right, and we got a narrative here uh, with some notification types. Um, these notifications are, are incidents that the officers can uh, chime into to get to the locations of the said notification incident. And all right, we will read the narrative. All right, event number 07122. Let's see if we can zoom in a little bit. Let's zoom out. Zoom in, try to keep it in frame here. 
All right. Well, we'll just read it this way. Responding officers uh, responded to a call to a shots fired call at above location, which turned out to be a person shot. Upon arrival, responding officers located Terry Burry, victim one, with multiple gunshot wounds. Responding officers later learned that there was a second victim, Marcus Clark, victim number two, also with multiple gunshot wounds. Terry Burry, victim, was transported by EMS number 52, Northwestern Hospital, and was seen by a doctor who pronounced Terry Berry at 1323 hours. Beat number 383 is currently with Terry Berry's remains and body removal will be ordered when ET is finished processing the body. Marcus Clark, victim, was taken to Stroger Hospital by EMS number 70 and is currently in stable condition, according to doctor. From the witnesses, witness account, offenders exited a black vehicle and started to fire multiple gunshots at the victims. The above listed vehicle was used by offenders and was located at redacted East 69th Street and is being processed by examining technicians. The vehicle was reported stolen under RD number listed. All above notifications made. Crime scene processed by uh, ET, uh, technicians and B officers. All right. And the rest is just officers um, according to the scene and also personnel. And that takes us down to the fourth page of this document. And that is the incident report uh, for the homicide of TB. Thanks for joining.